Hey everyone, welcome to my uh, first video where I'm going to introduce uh, exactly what I intend to do on this channel and uh, a few things that got me, that are the reason that I actually decided to start doing this. Uh, so first of all, I want to go ahead and let everyone know exactly what the point of this channel is. Um, lately, and I'll go into this further, um, I've just become very interested in the idea of either streaming or perhaps just creating videos to upload online. And so I decided I'm going to start doing that, at least temporarily. We'll see how it goes. Um, it, it's just for fun. I don't expect to be some big, famous Internet celebrity. Uh, so um, two of the concepts that I currently have planned are what I call Fall Guys Fridays and Wednesday Ramblings. So we'll start with Fall Guys Fridays. Uh, if you know what Fall Guys is, then you probably can already imagine what that's going to be. Uh, I will play... Fall Guys. Um, for those that don't know, that is a multiplayer uh, game in which everyone plays an adorable bean that you can dress up in all sorts of different skins. And your beans uh, run across a bunch of um, obstacle courses. Think of it as a mixture of um, Wipeout and games like that, as well as American Gladiators. There's some races where the object is to be the first to get to the finish line. There are some survival uh, games in which the object is to just outlast everyone else. There's a few other ones. There's some team games where it pairs you up into teams with random other teams. There's logic games, which I hate. I'm good at logic, but I hate their logic games. Um, and there's different modes that you can play in. There's the solo mode where you're just competing to do the best you can. And then there are uh, both duos and squad modes, in which case you, are, you can either... Uh, play with your own friends, which you can create your own um, online party and enter games that way, or you can be paired with a bunch of random people. And those games are similar. There's uh, some games that you can play in both solo and um, squad mode. There's some that only appear in one or the other. But uh, the, the main difference is that instead of um, just competing 100% for yourself, what you're doing is you're working with other people. It's lar there's a lot of, you're doing your own thing, but when you're racing, um, the way it works is if you come in first and there's 60 players, you get 60 points. The next player gets uh, 59, third place gets 58, so forth. Um, so every round, so many people are eliminated. And if your team's combined score is not high enough, you will be knocked out and will not advance to the next round. So you can actually do really well, but if your squad doesn't do well, be eliminated. So um, just all sorts of different fun. It's fun to watch people get knocked around. Um, it just goof off. It's not a very serious game, though I will cuss up a storm, so maybe I shouldn't say it's not too serious. But it's fun, and I hope you'll uh, enjoy watching me play and goof off during it. Um, my other idea is nothing groundbreaking, but I call it Wednesday ramblings, in which I will just talk about whatever I wish to. Uh, more than likely, it'll be something pop culture related from throughout the week, perhaps something I watched on TV or something that um, perhaps I read a comic book and want to talk about it. Maybe I'm reading a book that I need to talk about. Um, it could be something that I've heard about that I just want to talk about. Uh, whether or not I'll get into anything super real world, I don't know. Um, I'm Thinking of avoiding uh, politics and stuff like that. Not because it's not important, but because I kind of want this to be a fun channel for people to watch. Um, mental health is so important, and I, sometimes I just enjoy sitting and watching other people just have fun, and that's what I want to do. Now, I'm not saying that I won't weigh in on serious stuff. Uh, I may. Sometimes I get angry and I just feel like I have to say something. But right now, that's not the goal. And to be honest, there are people who are far more knowledgeable and emotionally strong to be able to talk about these issues that I don't really feel that I'm equipped to do. So right now, that's exactly what I have planned for Wednesday Ramblings. Uh, as we go along, I may add new concepts. I've already got a few ideas uh, in my head. Uh, I'll talk about them another time because they're not quite ready for me to actually begin working on. But um, for now, let's go ahead and tell you a little bit about the limitations of my channel. 
when I started this, originally my plan was to possibly start streaming, but unfortunately that's just not going to work for me. You see, um, where I live, internet is pretty limited with what you can get, and so switching to something faster is not really an option. I have tried streaming, and it did not work. The uh, it, it just cannot process the information very well. But I am able to record and upload the videos. They take way longer than most people, I'm sure. Uh, for example, a 30-minute video that I tried to upload the other day took two and a half hours. So um, I'm pretty sure that's way slower than most people's. And I, like I said, I can't switch. Uh, my current internet provider, they have stopped upgrading in the area. In fact, new customers cannot use them here. Um, but they do continue to service for those of us who have been with them for a while. So if I were to switch to a new company, A, I don't know how it's going to work, and B, if I'm not happy, the problem is that once, if I were to get rid of my current internet provider, I can't go back. They no longer accept new customers, so once I stop being one of their customers, I'm screwed if I don't have a better option. And I'm very, very hesitant to actually try and do to switch over. I don't like making changes like this. One other thing I want to discuss is that I am not a very tech savvy person, so don't expect a ton of editing in my videos. Um, I, it's just I, I don't know what I'm doing. Maybe eventually I'll I'll learn how to do that. Um, but right now, if there's a long section, like if I'm playing a game and there's a long, boring section. I don't have the option to remove that section and then just combine the beginning and the end. I, I don't know how to do that. I'm not tech savvy. I, I dread the concept of learning. I, it's just maybe eventually if, if, if I enjoy doing this uh, and continue it long term, I'll start learning how to do that. But right now, what you see is what you get. So now I want to talk to you about what actually got me into starting my own YouTube channel. Um, a few years back, I uh, somehow, looking on YouTube, I stumbled across Blue Television Games. Uh, Blue Television Games is run by a guy named Darby who plays a lot of uh, retro video games like Super Mario Brothers, Sonic the Hedgehog, as well as ROM hacks that other people have designed. And every now and then he'll post videos about these things. He also live streams, but I didn't really start paying attention to that at first. I just watched the videos. I especially loved his co-op videos with another streamer named Lair. Uh, those were a hoot, and I, I enjoyed watching them. Um, at some point after that, probably about a year and a half ago, I uh, stumbled across Jacksepticeye playing Among Us. And um, I'm a board game fan, and um, so I used to play social deduction games like uh, Ultimate Werewolf. And so Among Us is basically a video game version of that. You, uh, And so that really appealed to me, watching him and the other players that he was playing with. And one thing I do want to note is that uh, I, I happened to notice or recognize the voice of one of the people he was playing with is a guy whose videos I had watched about 10 years ago, a guy named Critical, who posted a hilarious uh, Quop video, that's Q-W-O-P, uh, from years ago. And as soon as I heard him in one of Jacksepticeye's um, Among Us videos, I immediately just recognized his voice. Uh, from there, I learned of some other Among Us players, uh, Valkyrie, Disguised Toast, and Saikuno. And uh, I, I just loved watching these people play Among Us. And that's actually what really got me into watching streams. Unfortunately, about the time that I actually started watching their streams, they kind of got tired of Among Us. And so they quit playing for quite some time. And though they were still streaming various other stuff, it wasn't stuff that personally appealed to me. So I didn't really keep up with them until earlier this year I discovered that many of uh, them are back playing uh, on Sussy Sundays. And so that is one of the things that I make sure to turn into every week is uh, Sussy Sundays. And while I watch it, there's a huge part of me that wishes I could play with them. Um, I don't want to go into too many details about why I quit social deduction games that I was playing, but there was a lot of stress, and I, I just got tired of dealing with people. And I just admired the way that they were interacting with each other. Uh, they were fun. I felt like maybe I could play with them without getting super angry. 
but of course they only play with other streamers. I, I, I didn't actually realize that when I started watching. I just thought these were random people just playing games. I didn't immediately know that they were producing all sorts of content. I thought it was just a group of friends who happened to be recording their games. Um, so I learned more about that afterwards. And so I, I just love the concept of, or the thought of playing with them or people like them. But again, like, I don't want to say they have a click, obviously, but they play with other streamers, which I was not a streamer. And so and I still am not because of my internet. But it's, you know, it just appealed to me so much. And uh, since they've started playing again, I've kind of paid a bit more attention to a few of the other things they've done. And um, they play a game called Fall Guys, which I've already talked about. And I just absolutely loved watching them play. So just on a whim, because it's a free game, I decided to download it a few weeks back. And I've just fallen in love. And so that's what really got me into looking up how to actually either stream or shoot videos and also enable other people to watch me play. Because before I did that, um, you know, I didn't download any program to let me do that. So I would occasionally, just, just for a friend, some private videos, I would uh, record myself using my cell phone and just recording my laptop. I'd record myself playing games, uh, primarily uh, getting over it with Benny Foddy. And it was fun, but you couldn't hear me that well. And you couldn't hear the volume of the game either. Um, so when I started doing this, I decided to look up to see how exactly is it that streamers are able to both have themselves on camera but also have it where you can actually see the screen and not just record yourself with your phone like I was doing. So I've discovered how to do that, and here I am. Um, so that basically tells you how I got into this. Uh, that tells you what to expect from this channel. I hope that's something that will appeal to you. Uh, over time, I will very likely add a few other things. I've, Like I said, I've already got a few different ideas uh, in my head. Um, but I want to start it slow. So right now, for sure, my the goal is to um, upload videos at least twice a week, Wednesday Ramblings and Fall Guys Fridays. And you just have to hopefully like and subscribe, and maybe you'll find a few more things popping up in the next few weeks. I really hope you enjoy this. I This is a brand new experience for me. I'm not used to being on camera or anything like that. And so I'm looking forward to see how this goes. Take care, everyone.